We got to get equipment unhooked this week, finish up a little bit of field work, leveling some spoil from ditch cleaning and widening. And what else? Uh, Unhook equipment and sheds, blow off combines, because it could be one of the last good warm weeks. Why are we accumulating so many of these? Chamois? Chamois, there you go. I don't know. Somebody taking them out of the old shop there? I wouldn't doubt it. Ooh. Don't, or I will have to put the big hurt on you. <laughs> Can I blow a combine off or what? He's awful close to my shop with old little Bob there. He's really digging her down. Got the bucket too flat. He's digging her down. So he's backfilling for the winter time so our snow buckets don't bust the cement, right? Correct. Or is he just doing it because he's bored? Mm, no, maybe that too. You gonna wash my pickup too or what? Well, I needed one of these. Oh boy. I missed a spot. Put the sponge and now I've got my shabby dirty. Mm -hmm. Sounds like that's what we're gonna do. Big sweet, you know how to run that? We're gonna blow off some equipment today. So that one's actually coming back in. That's been blown off and actually Kibble was out and inspected it. So that one's waiting for parts or whatever. Since it's under warranty, they will be fixing it. There wasn't that much stuff wrong with it though. Deer quality, you know. Boom. Gotta blow off the 9870 here. This corn head, the 45 foot draper, which I don't know if this combine will lift, but we're gonna try it, you know that. Then the 35 foot flex head for this combine. So I got a lot of blowing stuff off to do. So it's super windy today. That's good and bad. It's good for blowing it off because you blow it, get it loose with the salt air, and it's gone down into the field, out in the field, and it's, don't get me as dirty. It's a lot more pleasant blowing it off. But it's gonna be kinda cold. It feels like 34, sustained 25 mile an hour winds, so it's, it's a pretty, pretty ugly outside as far as for videoing. Ugh! Good night. So we're actually gonna blow it off on the gravel because the frost is coming out. It's gonna be warming up this week. The ground is frozen, but when the frost comes out, plus it rained a little bit before, it's gonna be mud. When frost comes out of the ground, it just gets wet. So we're gonna do it on the gravel and hopefully most of it just blows away and gets out into the field, is the hope. Terrible. You can see how full the LP tank is. That's kind of cool, 42%. So this is something we try to do every winter around the building since we don't have cement here. We really want to get cement here really bad, but just financially in the budget yet. But it's really hard on the edge of the concrete with your snow bucket cleaning around there. So we try to get this gravel up there so when the gravel freezes, it kind of directs the bucket from gouging the concrete too badly. It's better than a one inch lip there. Found my Larson Farms uh, hat finally. It was under a bunch of crap in my backseat of my pickup. I'm sure I'm not the only guy that has like every winter coat that I own in the back of my pickup because you never know how many you need to wear a day. You know what I'm saying? 
Carhartts, gloves, hats, extra socks, boots. Yeah, about four GoPros and a bunch of other crap. And this was at the bottom. Don't you do it! Don't you do it! Hey! Hey! Is it cold? I'm going inside. Good luck. <laughs> Good luck. That was miserable. That was nine and a half minutes and I'm so cold. Face is numb. Eyeballs are filled full. Filled full. Gah. I'm not a fan of winter. I wish the buggy wheel didn't break off the buggy for my ancestors. Do you think that both of our ancestors buggy wheels broke off in the same area? That's why we're stuck in this miserable cold tundra. Mine stopped to help yours. <laughs> Want that move? No, we're good. Hitchhiking. You know, I should be faster at this. You need a ride? It's, very it's cool. pretty cold. I'll clean out my office. It's locked. It's locked. <laughs> I wish I could run my phone faster. Wow. It's terrible. Wow. You don't even need the po power of the elite thing. The solar, not really. Whoosh. It's gonna work great, but if it is cold, I got the wife coming with more face protection. Nice hat. Hey, thanks. They're on farm focus, did you know that? Yeah, they better get them ordered for Christmas because, you know, mail. Christmas order, better get it going. Mail is super slow, so is producing them. Yes, because of COVID. Lack of people. Right. But they're doing it safely. What are you looking at? This might be a new low. I always want to blow off all the machinery when it's nice out, but we always want to do field work. Then I end up getting to work in conditions like this. Oh man. GoPro batteries don't like to get cold because they both died on me so I couldn't record anymore. But we got her done. Yeah! I'm done! It took you a while. I normally say three to four hours on a on a good one. Good job. How do I look? I'm exhausted, you know, for everything I was doing out there. What was that? You did good though. I can't hear you. Oh. That was hard work. Yes it is. That's no fun. I'm glad you volunteered. Look. 
Looks better than uh, just a little air compressor hose. <laughs> I was thinking about that when you were doing it. Yeah, I go out there this temp with the standard air compressor and your nozzle freezes up every minute. That nozzle actually moves so much air it keeps your hands warm. My left hand, I was wearing a thin glove and the right hand up on the rubber hose where it stays cooler. Yeah. I had a uh, much thicker one. Are we gonna park them heads? I don't know, where do you want your heads parked? What have you been working on? Fixing the door. What you happened? Should go see it. What happened? Well, it got rotted off, Mother Nature and wood. <laughs> Not good. My eyes are pretty full. Goggles it's in kept the dust. fogging up. That's a necessary job, but boy, is that a hard working job. Dragging that big hose around and then constant pressure up over your head working. Yeah, that's fun. I don't mind it, honestly, but it, it is a dirty, dirty, hard job. And today's wind kind of sucked, but it's done. I don't have to do it for a year. That's something great to look forward to. You guys got to watch it. So thanks for watching. We appreciate every single one of you viewers. Please don't forget to come back and watch the next one. We appreciate it. See you next time. Oh, can I please shower? God, that feels so great right now. I need to fight with these things again. Which one is the dryer? That's the dryer. You think they need to be washed? Mm. Don't make a dust, your dad gets upset. Nicole always appreciates when I wash this dirty stuff at the farm. All right. Would you call this a heavy duty load? I might. Where are the tie pods? Here's the tide, but it must be the liquid version. That one wasn't opened yet. We're going heavy duty because it looks heavy duty to me. Go.